Hey guys, Cell here. Welcome back to some more Nikkei. Now, let's see if we can get another SSR, shall we? And after this, I need to make sure I go back to Guilty instantly. Can't let what happened last time with Mihara happen again. Literally less on 30 points. Actually, I think I lost on 50 points. Yeah, I did. That sucked. I could have got her, I think, tomorrow if I didn't. See ya. Gonna go to get, talk to Guilty, and then we will head over to Yuri. And hopefully it's as fun with her as it was with Mihara. I literally would have had Guilty today. Had, you know... Well, actually, I mean, on reset, I, I still would have got her today, but... Last reset, I could have. Had I not missed her. Uh. Uh. Uh, you always do that. Why do you keep hitting me? It hurts. It hurts. Yes. Uh huh. So it hurts. Uh huh. How come it hurts even when I paint sensors are turned off? Who knows? Maybe she's got magic fingers or something. She was able to turn on our pain sensors remotely. That's it. I can control Nikki's senses. Just like this. First, I turn on the pain center. Anissa's thigh starts trembling. Ouch. And then I give it a smack. Does it hurt Anis? Oh, it hurts, yes. This won't hurt a bit. Um... It didn't hurt at all. It felt more like a slap on the wrist. Exactly. Don't don't feed into her wanting to hear about how painful it is. Really? Yep, no pain whatsoever. I'm honest. Your eyes seem to be welling up. That's not because it hurts. I'm just really emotional right now. <laughs> yeah, whatever you say. You call that a punch? That was so pathetic, it almost makes me cry. Uh-huh. But, how can there be no pain? Hmm, is someone tickling me right now? Is there some kind of nanobug? Oh no. Ah. Much better. Yuni walks away excitedly. Geez, that stings. My thigh feels like it's going to explode. It looks pretty gnarly as well. I don't like her. I've let it slide a few times now, but there's no need end to her smacking us around. I keep telling her how much it hurts, but she doesn't listen. Commander, what do you think? It is kind of getting a bit out of hand. She's only doing it because she likes you. <laughs> oh, do I feed into her desires? Do I feed into the troubles of an S? You know what, sure, why not? Well, the feeling isn't mutual. Mihara, you're in the same squad as her. What do you think about all of this? I think it's great. Uni hits really hard. Then you should be her punching bag. You know, Uni usually isn't able to feel anything. It's only when her skin comes into direct contact with another that she feels any kind of sensation. In the beginning, she was happy with some gentle caressing or stroking. You talk like this is a game to you. It makes perfect sense. Too much repetition dulls the senses. It's only natural to start taking out stronger stimulation. That's why she has moved on to hitting. Because it feels different to hit different people, so we have to find more people to hit. Why, when you put it like that, she seems kind of freaky. It seems that amongst all of you, her favorite is... Yep. Honey's. Me. You got it. She must get some special sensation from hitting you. It feels like I'm going to die. But why Anis and not Mihara? 
Happy holidays. Hmm. She enjoys being hit. I really love it. That's why Uni doesn't like it. She wants all the pleasure, but I enjoy it just as much as she does. I am officially bailing out of this conversation. But it is becoming a problem. There's no denying that. The HR team at Miss Lee's is having a hard time with incoming complaints recently. As for the reason, I'm sure that no explanation is necessary, correct? Let me guess. She's going around treating everyone like her own personal pinata. It has been a topic of discussion, yes. Commander, with that being said... What is that? Can you educate Uni? Educate? I was hoping you can educate Uni. On proper physical communication. I don't think that is my field of expertise. No, I'm pretty sure it is. I'm quite observant and I have a knack for understanding people. And you, Commander, have potential. What, the potential to be also be an S? Or an M whenever I see fit? Happy, you think so too, right? A little. She stole me under the bus again. Robbie, what's with you when it comes to these two? I'm not saying anything more than that. See, I told you. So, Commander, we'll leave Uni in your hands. I have done all I can for her at this point. Uni and I have spent a lot of time together, and this and that is why we can communicate physically. We already have a perfect relationship. But don't you feel it's unfair to you need to stop there? Leaving her with only one person with whom she can communicate. So Commander, I'm asking you to do me this favor. Please communicate with Uni. I'll try my best. Excellent, I knew you'd come around. Master, what are you planning to do? Um, I suppose the first order of business is letting Uni hit me. No, don't subdue to the yes. What? <laughs> Very good. No, not sugar. You know, I'm gonna, I, I want Uni to do this to shift up for not giving us a sugar swimsuit. Just saying. Exia, come on, don't hit the gamer. Ouch. Maxwell? Well, I mean, Maxwell's into griefing, so uh, she might like this. Oof. No, not poor Vesti. Eh. <laughs> She's going around everywhere to find her next kink. Stop. What is that? Stop what? Stop hitting them. No way. Uh -huh. You're hurting them. But it's so much fun. Hit me instead. Hit me instead. Commander. No, you're too weak, Commander. Of course I'd enjoy the sensation of making contact. But I would have to go much too easy on you, otherwise you'd get hurt. You're different from us. Don't worry, I'm stronger than I look. No kidding, you know how many times I've lived through dangerous situations? Really, I can hit you. I'm ready. <laughs> hmm, this makes me happy, but why are you doing this? Are you interested in this kind of stuff now? <laughs> no. But I have to because Robbie keeps throwing me under the bus. Last time it was fun. This time is going to be just painful. I want to communicate with you physically. Huh? With me? Uh huh. Oh, Commander. That's not something just anyone can do. First, just hit me. 
Are you sure? All right then, here I go. I mean, technically, this is... Would she, she wouldn't normally be able to hit a human, right? She has to obviously have her consent. Otherwise, uh, her nymph would stop her, right? Do it. Just like I imagined. You are different from the rest. This is a different feeling entirely than hitting the case. Uh-huh. You're getting back at your human oppressors by hitting me, aren't you? Look, it's not my fault Shu Yan doesn't like you, okay? Uh-huh, oh, Commander! How is your Commander? How? How do you feel? Look. Uh, enduring the pain will just make her not enjoy what's going on. You have to tell her it hurts. Otherwise, she'll just go smacking other people. She wants to know how it hurts, how it feels, because she can't feel it herself. It hurts. Okay, so what? You wanted me to enjoy it instead? This is hardly communicating, Commander. It's just small talk. How is it, Commander? Wait. But but when Mihara said that to pretend at it, but Mihara likes it. Oh God, do I gotta. Okay, let's try to pretend to enjoy it. Ugh. Ow. No more. What is that? Commander, you don't know how to communicate. You're just letting your body sensations shoot out of your mouth. All I hear is screams, moans, etc. That's not communication. Commander, you haven't been hit a lot, right? Of course not. No. Yes, I thought so. People with a lot of experience are able to hear it. It may be subtle, but they can hear the words that come from the bodies of the others. Once you need response to that, that's when real communication is achieved. So endure it. Come here, do you have a one-dimensional view of the world? To be frank, he feels humiliated. <laughs> This is I imagine. Maybe Mihana really is all I have. She's the only one who can com communicate with Uni. Uni walks away dejected. I can't just leave it like this. I can't disappoint Uni. Okay, so what happens when you enjoy the pain? Can you enjoy it? Taking the pain won't resolve anything. After all, we have to communicate with each other. Yeah, see? Even enjoying the pain does not help at all. So what happens when you tell her it hurts the second time? It hurts. Yep, she's disappointed either way. Yep, yep, either way she gets disappointed. I just have to go look. Honey, did you hear? Here what? What is there's a perfect wandering glutes around the ark? A perfect? Larger. They'll pop out of nowhere. And then, they ask to be hit. Ew. No. No, are we the perverts walking around? Are we the pervert walking around asking people to hit us? So we can get a better understanding of what it's like to be hit by all, all sorts of people. We're doing this all for you, aren't we? They don't go up to anyone regardless of gender. Really, even the elderly. That's all hours of the day, too, from dusk to dawn. Oh my god. On a train in a cafe, even in the middle of the street. How awful. Then one thing at the beating they desired so much. They leave the scene like nothing happened in search of their next prey. 
What is this world come to? It feels like the ark gets worse and worse every day. You see that? But is your purse so squeaky clean? It absolutely is. There aren't any perverts making their way up here. <laughs> oh, there probably is. The door opens with a loud noise, and here out comes the pervert. Uh, Commander, seems like you've been busy lately. Do we have a bunch of bruises on us right now? <laughs> Master, did you hear? Recently, there have been reports in the arc of a perv. They see a. <laughs> Oh my god, I've been waiting for this. Nail, Anis. Hit me. <laughs> Come on. Hit me. Um, wait a minute. Have you been wandering around the ark these last few days? Yes. Have you been asking random people on the street to hit you? <laughs> yes. Is that why you're asking us to hit you now? Yes. Neil, and have you got the tool? Roger. Shoot. Yes, Commander. Wait, what? Hmm, I didn't realize you were in such a situation. How heartbreaking. A conversation carried out with one fist. Sounds like something out of a comic book. This isn't at all like a fist fight out of a comic book. Kids shouldn't do that kind of stuff anyway. But according to uni, the only way to progress is to get hit a lot, right? Sounds about right for her. Commander. Are you okay with that? I mean, I've been going around for the last few days at telling people to hit me, right? <laughs> then I did it to you two. Is this really the only way? To be completely honest, you need just one Nikkei. I don't think it's a smart idea. For you to harm yourself like this just for one Nikkei. You're as sympathetic to the plight of others as always, Anis. I'm just saying, what if the commander ends up getting seriously hurt? I mean, it hasn't happened yet. Uni seems lonely. I want to be someone who can communicate with her. Okay, that sounds more like the commander I know. That's why I like. Oh my, Anis. Just coming out straight like that and saying it during Uni's bond. Huh. What was that? No, it's nothing. Okay then, let's do it. Count me out. A discipline can never... A, a disciple can never lay their hands upon a master whom they so revere. So to do so would be unthinkable. But weren't you supposed to be a spy? A spy would be able to do it. You remember that limited edition cartridge in case you buy it. Well, the dragon sheep that was rusted out. The commander threw it that away, thinking it was garbage. Oh, wow. Wow. You're making her build the rage up. Why, you? Oh, no. Oh, no. Since then, I've met a lot of people in trade. At some point, at some point, a light bulb went off in my head. What, if I unlock the S tendency trait? It was from then on. I was able to feel it. The meaning. Meaning. The emotions. <laughs> we went to Pravati! This poor girl. She literally saw us walking behind her as a dog, and now she's literally being told to hit us. Why are we go going to a government official? Well, I mean, one of the government dogs. Why? Why? <laughs> you want me to hit you? Are you out of your mind? I felt a sense of excitement facing this uncharted territory. Oh no. If you insist, Commander. Of course you would accept. Of course you would. 
After looking at a few of your advisors, I'm not surprised. Ecstasy. Oh my god, no. We did not go to Ingrid for this. We did not ch we did not start chasing a high so far that we would go to one of the big three. You're kidding me. Animosity. Oh no, not poor Emma. Wait, are you serious? Butterflies in my stomach. <laughs> Wait, we even went to the snow for Ludmira? You came all this way to ask me that. Oh, Ludmila, I'm so sorry for this. <laughs> Inferiority. Okay, look, this actually makes sense. Yun Hua, she doesn't particularly like us. Also... Nice. I've never paid attention to Yun Hua, but nice. Bloodlust. I was able to feel an abundance of emotions. I was able to per perfectly grasp what type of person they were. And at that moment, I was sure I would be able to communicate with Uni. <laughs> I appreciate all the effort you put into this, Commander. It makes Uni very happy. You are the first person who has done something like this for Uni. Ah, I cannot wait to hit you, Commander. I got your message. He wanted to communicate with Uni. That's more so we, we unlock the M tendency, not the S, but sure. Commander, this is not something that can be accomplished in a single day. I heard those rumors that you, that was you, wasn't it? <laughs> I'm glad to see you working so hard in such a short period of time. Yeah. Commander, are you alright? Why are you making that face? I want to hit you. Stop making that face. It makes me want to hit you so badly. C Commander, did you just say you can do better than that? <laughs> yeah. I don't respond. You mean to say that there's no need for you to say it out loud? Yes, that's because you're talking right now. You felt a little sting. Okay. <laughs> I see. This is perfect. Oh, jeez. Unbelievable. Unbelievable, Commander. Right now, Uni is having a conversation with the Commander. Stop. Hmm. What's wrong? Uni is only getting started. Is that all you've got? What? Are you saying that Uni is holding back? No, Commander, you're wrong. Until now, Uni. I cannot feel your emotions. You can't feel my emotions. I'm disappointed in you, Commander. Uni believed that the Commander had truly grown in such a short period of time. Uni must have misunderstood. You are merely reacting to my words. Wait, what? <laughs> so you really do understand? You wouldn't say that if you weren't truly communicating with Uni. This is not communication. Right now, you are merely a machine that moves when you are told. But what are you saying? You are not communicating with me. You are merely listening to what I am saying. Commander, are you rejecting Uni? Uni has finally found someone to communicate with. You are just trying to please me. This is not communicating. N no, Uni is communicating. During my training, I came to realize something. Those who hit me revealed their true selves. Their true selves. 
What is the point of all this? Pleasing someone else is real. Is this the communication you were speaking of? No. That is not communication. Well, yes, it's just too much trouble. Beanie has been in the dark. Only reacting to words that I would hear every once in a while. Beanie's voice reads me harder than no one else. I have isolated myself. I thought I was lonely. But it was my own self-imposed in isolation. I did not attempt to communicate. The commander, what should I do? I want to communicate. But I have forgotten how to speak. I will help you reclaim the voice you have lost. You will? Yes, I will show you the way. Oh, God. To teach me. Lift up your head. Fine. Now let's communicate. Deal. No, not like that. Uh huh. Show me who you really are. Uh. Not yet, show me more. What is this? Commander, can you tell what a kind of a person I am? Not yet. Okay. I'll try harder. This line of communication reverberated through the halls for some time. Honeys, did you hear? What rumors? About the perfect who's been terrorizing New York the past few days. The commander certainly is working hard. This time it's a duo. <laughs> them in uni. Roger. They apparently call themselves those who speak. Those who speak? Give me a break. More like those who never shut up. The commander needs to pull himself together and stop wandering around like this. But there is something a bit strange about this rumor. What do you mean? It's just that all the people who have been hit are... Never mind. None of this is really my wheelhouse, so I shouldn't say too much. What is that? Anyway, what else have you been up to, Mihara? Waiting. For who? The two who possess the power to awaken others. Just go home. Why do you keep coming here? This place is cramped enough as it is. Aha, uh -huh. do you not like small spaces? The electricity in the air is a body is drawn near. And the joy and feverishness that when our skin actually touches, isn't it nice? I don't know what you're talking about. Just go home. Huh? I sense a presence. We are here. <laughs> ah, yes. Enter the area with a the, with a whip. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Uh -huh. Does it hurt? What are you a ninja now? Ah, uh, why are you asking? What's for dinner already? What? We truly have awakened Anis! Oh my god. We've gotten a full new form of power! <laughs> she was able to understand Uni already. What is that? What is that? What made you see that? I, I don't know. How strange. Just now. <laughs> Anis! Do you know what I'm saying to you? Oh, we don't have the ingredients to make curry right now. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, but I am completely lost right now. What is going on? Why is Ani saying weird things all of a sudden? When she hit me, it made me feel... Feel... No. No, no, no. I don't want to go to that kind of world. <laughs> And she ran away. 
Uh, Naomi, would you like to talk with me too? Um, I'm good, thanks. I'm perfectly happy using my ears to hear things. I'd rather not add any more conversations into the mix. Naomi's camp is off. Wonderful, just wonderful. Uni, are you finally able to communicate? Yes. I presume so. I was right about the commander. A new commander have potential. He may well be a genius. The commander says that's not that's an overstatement. Uni said that she is jealous of Mihara complimenting me. Well, it doesn't compare to my jealousy. You both were having such an intimate conversation, and I had no idea. Uni, are you no longer lonely? Yes, I'm not lonely anymore. The commander made me realize that blurting out one's thoughts without considering other people's feelings is just another form of violence. Only attempting to please others is no way to communicate either. Real communication is done by exchanging one's words, one's thoughts back and forth. Getting to know one another. Now I realize what true communication is. Now there are two people I can talk to. Two people whom I cherish dearly. People who listen to my real voice and allow me to hear theirs. So I'm not lonely anymore. Not at all. I'm happy. Uni. I am. Ouch. Mihara. It's been a long time since you spoke to Uni, right? Uh-huh. That's right. We have a lot of catching up to do. Yes. I'll let you two have some time alone. Huh, Commander? Where are you going? The three of us can communicate together. Yes, I'd very much like to hear the commander's voice. <laughs> this may get a bit rowdy. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh boy. The sounds of the three of them speaking echoed in the halls for some time. So, I guess I unlocked some powers of the S and the M. I became both to fully be able to communicate with Uni. <laughs> okay, look, yeah, no, that was not anywhere near as fun as Mihara's was. It was interesting. It was funny when we were, you know, call it a pervert, walking around asking people to hit us. But yeah, either way, Mihara's still way outclasses Uni's bond in terms of entertainment value. <laughs> That was a major lag for Uni's voice. Alright, and with that, I'm going to be ending Uni's bond here. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next one. Which, let's see, I've got the, uh... Barbecue Master story to do. All of the side stories that have shown up so far in the event. I need to compile all of that together. Depending on how long it is, maybe one or two episodes. And Guilty is also going to be fully unlocked today. When I actually finish everything I need for her. So I could then do her stuff as well. I haven't recorded a single bit of it, so... It's going to be completely new to me. So yeah, I got a decent bit to do. So yeah, either way, till then, I will see you guys later.